Hello everyone, Pavlock here. Today I'm going to be starting my first playthrough of Crash Bandicoot Warp on the PS1 on my 60GB uh, PlayStation 3 that's backwards compatible where you can play both your PS3, PS2, and PS1 games. Uh, I thought this would be a great playthrough to start off with because Crash Bandicoot is pretty much my uh, favorite video game character growing up back in the day and it was my favorite, like my first PlayStation game back when the PS1 was released. So, without further ado, we're going to get started here. I kind of kept the disc, like the uh, the first Crash Bandicoot, well not the first one, but uh, Crash Bandicoot Warp for the PS1 ever since I had it. But I don't have the PS1 anymore because ever since the PS2 came out, I just kind of got rid of it and all that. So. Brings back so much memories. A Universal Interactive Studios production. It's been a while since I ever played this game, so <laughs> try to see if I can still play this game. Crash Bandicoot War. So here we go. Let's <laughs> <sighs> just turn up the volume. Oh, it cannot be. Uka Uka has risen. Hey, Uka Uka. It was Pow Black who committed to crime. Simple instructions to follow, but you lost the gems, you lost the crystals, and I have lost my patience. There is now no other power source left on this planet. I know we have you, unfortunate setbacks, and failed. But since your bumbling has managed to set me free, Generous. There is still a way for us to amass the power needed to enslave this miserable planet. And this time, this time the great Uka Uka will make sure that you do it right. After I think that was Andrew, if as I remember. Crash Bandicoot, uh, Coco Bandicoot on the right. I thought that was his girlfriend at first, but it was his sister. He must be stopped. Especially from the pause menu, the way they would look at each other. Uka Uka and Cortex plan to use this time twisting machine to gather crystals that lay scattered across time. I have brought you here to recover the crystals before they do so. To open the time portal, simply stand on a button and then jump into the portal. Good luck. All right, here we go. I gotta make sure I've got the my memory card set in my PS1 so I can save. So let's begin. Toad Village, and I think the boss here was Tony, or not Tony, but uh, Tiny the Tiger. <laughs> crash, 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 why must you always muck in my mud? Oh look, I have a mask helping me too. 
We will find out which one is more powerful soon enough. I can't believe I actually said Tony the Tiger instead of Tiny. So here we go. Tiny Village. Or Toe Village. Can't play this game in forever. Feels good to be playing a game that they don't make anymore. I wish they made like newer versions for the PS3. Apu Apu train. Checkpoint, first checkpoint. Get that goat out of here. Free life. Just had to adjust the camera a little bit. Zoom out a little bit. Uh, there you go. A little bit higher. There you go. All right. Sorry about that. Now we got a much powerful Aku Aku. The first bonus stage. <laughs> Another extra life, two extra lives. I just remember when you get killed by the, if you touch the toad and you don't have like the uh, protection of Aku Aku, I think the, uh, the toad is supposed to kiss you. I don't know how you lose a life from that, but whatever. <laughs> First crystal. Two more bosses. Last two bosses. And a gem. Good stuff. The first crystal and the first gem. Yeah, <laughs> I remember this. Each time you get a gem, or pretty much all the stuff that you need. I think it's just pretty much the gem, so go back and save up. So I just started. Uh, throwing that shack in there. Start stage two under pressure in the next video.